Hey bestie, I'm Kenya and welcome to my channel. I'm so grateful and super thankful that you're joining in to play with me today. So in this video, I will be setting up my June monthly calendar and I pulled all of these sticker books, y'all. I'm using all of them. So if you want to see how my monthly calendar comes together, then you already know. Stay tuned. Okay, bestie. So first up, let's talk about these stickers that I pulled. I pulled the Black Girl Magic sticker pack from Wrong Wrong, and I really wanted to use that doll. I thought a doll would look cute on my monthly. I pulled some colorful boxes and this functional box because I needed some monthly stickers out of it. And then I also pulled all of these, some memory keeping sticker books sticker books as well as some wrong wrong that this is my year and i can and i will sticker book now let me tell you why i pulled all of these but before i do that let me show y'all these like big letters that i got from dollar tree uh yeah don't sleep on dollar tree y'all they be having some good some good items in there and i absolutely love these so i picked them up from there and this is what i pulled y'all this is why i used all those sticker books because i pulled all these little icons and stuff because that was just what i was kind of feeling you know and look at her the doll like she's so cute and here are those monthly stickers that i got out of that functional sticker book so this is what I'm going with. Now, I don't know exactly how I want to lay them out. So we're just going to flow with this spread. And But I do know I want June to kind of go through the middle of the spread. So that's what I'm going to start out with. And I kind of want the doll to go next to it. So I'm going to start there. So let's put down the end first. And we're going to kind of see like how I can angle it. I was just thinking end maybe need to go First, so I can see where I need to put the doll to and I may need to put it over just a little bit I'm gonna put the U I'm just trying to measure it out y'all and I actually feel like on this level it looks cute but then I don't want to take up too much like writing room with this as well so I'm trying to be mindful of the days so I might need to move it in between these two rows so that way I have some writing room on both sets of the days in case I need to put in like some little icons or something. So I'm looking at that and I'm like, yeah, I need to like move it down, especially with her being um, a little bit bigger. So I'm going to move these. I'm going to lift them up and just move them down just a little bit and over some so I can move and make sure she's centered. Okay, that's, I feel like, y'all, I love these letters. These letters are so cute. And the good thing about these is you can color them. So the next time I use them, I'll probably color them. I should have got two of these packs, y'all. I really should have because I just feel like they're so fun. A fun pack of color for a dollar and 25 cents. I mean, you know, you can't beat that with a stick. Okay. Look at her. She's cute. And she is like, yes, honey, we outside we are outside okay <laughs> okay so now that i got her i thought well let me put my um little monthly boxes down you know i like to use these i like to use four of them on every monthly spread and then for the remainder boxes i can do some layering and i can use icons to put in my other plans so and you guys if you don't know this um one of my biggest tips to doing a monthly spread for me personally i always like the spread better when i just do it in a balanced way and then once i fill it in most likely i will have something to write on the days um now there are times where i don't have anything to write and i just leave it blank because it looks cute it don't bother me if it's blank but I like for my spread to look good and not look off centered. Back in the day when I was just putting in like, okay, I know I got this on this day. I know I got that on this day. I felt a little off doing that because one, I ended up not really liking how the spread looked. And then two, when I went in to write later on, like if I needed something else came up on my calendar. And I guess I should say that this calendar is constantly getting filled out throughout the month. It's not something I do it before the pen on. Well, I do it before the pen, but then I'm writing in it, you know, as the month goes on because plans change or things come up. We add to the schedule and all types of things. So with that being in mind, it was a little bit harder for me to plan the other way that I was doing it. So when I do it this way, my spread is already balanced out. 
and I have other room and other ways to put in my plans so I just like it this way this way better so if you haven't tried doing it this way definitely give it a go because I'm telling you it it works okay so I did want to put this little vacation sticker down because in June I will be going on vacation thank you Jesus okay thank you Lord for the rest <laughs> the rest lord thank you okay so i wanted and that's what this kind of like like i guess you could say inspired the spread i was like you know going on vacation we're packing and everything and i remember the memory keeping book having like this little vacation page with like a little passport and like you know things that you would pack like a little makeup bag and stuff so I just thought, well, I'm going to go with that. And I remembered the wrong wrong stickers had like little outfits and stuff like that. So that's just kind of like my little my little thing that I'm going with. And I feel like it's going to be cute. I put I'm just throwing these little icons throughout the spread. Y'all just wherever I feel, you know, makes sense. You know, I got my little matcha, my little matcha uh, shake what a well, frappuccino. <laughs> I'm gonna put that down. I like these little swan glasses. I really like them because they were pink and they added a little punch of color on that side. Okay, put my passport down. I got my wedges. Okay, and then I got me some shorts. Some little shorts that I could put down. But before I do that, because it was a clothing item, I decided to break it up with a little ice cream cone, a little ice cream sundae. And then I'm gonna put my shorts down and my little crop top. Okay, because it's summer. A little floral detail yeah i thought this was cute and i think because i did pull so many different books it still goes you know because it's all illustrated art and everything but it's all look little large icons so i thought that could be my decorative element i put a little strawberry down there and then i put this bag and i'm gonna make the bag kind of come off the page because it is a larger sticker so i figured i could use it on another portion of the page as well and put my sunglasses down here I thought that was cute and then I have this makeup bag which I really 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 wanted to use you guys and then I have another pair of heels and before I do that though because these heels match the bathing suit because they got like a little stripe to them I thought that was cute I'm gonna lay my little bathing suit down put my heels down I don't know where I'm going <laughs> where am I going okay I got my earrings and then I have another ice cream cone. And then I just pulled all types of stuff, you guys. I pulled some fruit. I just, little icons that I could find that kind of went with the summer and vacay, things you would do on vacay. I love fruit, though. So that was a whole thing as well. I just put some down. Put a little pineapple because she looked like she's tropical, like she's ready for a little night out on a tropical island or something. And then I also put some little um, shoes I believe they're Converse down there at the bottom. Chuck Taylors. And then I have this watermelon. I'm gonna kind of hang it off the spread. I got some more little things like some little makeup items and some more strawberries and those headphones, y'all. I thought the headphones would look really, really cute on the page as well. Cause you know, when you're, well, in today's world, we wear, you know, buds, but, or AirPods, but, um, you know, I mean, a good traditional headphone. I mean, I was a 90s kid. Okay. So listen, we rocked our headphones. Y'all, isn't it cute? And I just decorated the bottom of the um, spread with it. So I thought this was so cute. I'm going to lift this little lipstick up and put it next to the um, drink and put this makeup brush, this little powder brush down. And I had some little um, hair pins too, y'all. Just all like little cute stuff, okay? I thought this camera was really cute. So I'm going to put it down because, you know, when you're on vacay, you got to take pictures for your memories, number one, and then for the grant. I mean, yeah. <laughs> then I thought, y'all, I don't know. I pulled the sun because, I mean, it's the sun and it's summertime. So I just... I was like, I want to use that sun. I don't know if it really grow, goes, but I want to use it. And I just punched the page. Well, I didn't punch it. I cut it so I could kind of maneuver the pages a little bit. So that was that transition. And I put the other part of the bag on the other side, just at the top. So it just looks like it, it kind of goes there. And now I'm going to put my other little strawberries in here. 
just to kind of fill it in just a little bit and literally y'all i'm packing all the things with this spread y'all i got food i got i'm going swimming i'm going to a day party or something <laughs> i don't know i'm just trying to like these little outfits i'm sleeping good getting good rest on vacay i'm eating ice cream because you know that's what you do i'm eating watermelon which is like my favorite strawberries are one of my favorites too now i'm using this little white pen behind the sun because i was trying to make it look seamless but it wasn't working y'all i think i left it open and it dried out on me so i'm going to use this white out and just make it work and you can't really t you can't even tell that i use white out so it looks good okay so now that i got that y'all i feel good about it so now i'm trying to think okay i need to add in just a little bit more functionality on a few days because i at this point once i have it balanced then i feel like okay then i can go in and add things that i know i would have so and this is what i mean by balance you guys like the boxes are balanced it, the spread looks even you know and everything so now i can go in and add in my little like little icons or maybe even some little skinny boxes or something and i'm going to add in a couple of things here on this day because i know i have some like some events and stuff we got going on and just that i want to notate and then i was thinking i could put some other things like i could put something on this saturday as well on this friday but then also i thought well kenya <laughs> i want to do you want to make sure that i have plenty of room to write and not clutter it with too many boxes so let me make sure i'm doing that i'm gonna put this one down though because we got an event to go to on there that's actually father's day and juneteenth y'all it's gonna be that weekend all of the weekends in june are gonna be awesome okay because it's so much going on like i guess just one of the reasons why i love the summertime is because you know people are outside they are enjoying life and there's things happening you know so i'm just i'm excited um so i thought let me see what else i can put down and then i went in and saw these little icons and i was like mm, before i commit to that though i want to make sure i have room because that is a day that's like a little bit compromised because of the letter then i had these little flags too that i thought were really cute to pop on the spread but like i said let me just wait let me wait on all of that so i'm just looking at it you guys and trying to you know make sure i i feel like i'm, I'm good with it though so what i'm gonna do is work on the top and so, so i'm just gonna white out june in 2022 i mean i know the month i mean it's on the spread but i know the year as well and i'm gonna add in this washi tape it's some skinny washi and i just thought a little punch of color at the top would you know go and i really pulled this blue because that blue in that makeup bag and then the um blue in her shorts of the doll i thought they really stood out on the spread so i thought this would look good at the top of it so i'm gonna just do that and then i'm gonna clean it up with my exacto knife because i just feel like it'll look better clean like you know fit to the monthly boxes and like it looks good already i was like i really like that i did that really like how it's turning out y'all so share with me you guys below are you going on vacay this summer what are your vacay plans like are you excited about it you going with family you going on a girl's trip family trip guys trip like what's the tea like where are we going where are we are we traveling are we going to be doing a lot of like are we doing a staycation that's cool too you know what i'm saying you might be living in a popping city okay they just got a lot of things going on so just let me know let me know your your thoughts and everything below okay so that's pretty much it for this plan with me you guys i really like how the spread turned out i just wanted to do a bunch of icons and make it fun and everything and i'm excited to write in this baby now so yeah i want to thank you all so much for watching please like comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and as always i want to thank you all for being so sweet and so kind so yeah until next time i love you guys bye